morning guys it's 7 46 oh my god i know i'm awake before nine um i literally i couldn't fall asleep till two but i got up at 6 30 anyway because i was like i literally need to reset my body clock and what way better way to do it than to force myself to go through a whole day on a four and a half hours sleep long um but yeah so i'm just finishing this translation that's due at nine so i don't really want to hand it in just before nine because everybody else already handed it in so i have finished it i just wanted to check it with a fresh head if you know what i mean not that my head is very fresh but perfect start to week five <laughs> I've been working on and off like from nine till two um check those bags i'm gonna have a quick 20 minute nap and then i have a class at three um and then i have a class at 4 30 um so yeah and then i'm gonna get back have dinner try and just work a bit tonight like just try and get something done i need to get this essay done by wednesday night and it's just not gonna happen objectively which is really annoying me but i don't really have like i don't know how to solve this situation like there's not really much else i can do um yeah we'll see how this week goes to be honest i think this week is going to be the worst week in terms of workload but who knows i might like read the poems tonight again and be like oh actually this isn't as bad as i remembered we'll see i can't even remember how many poems there are but right now i'm gonna have a nap i've only got 20 minutes to have a nap so i'm gonna do it now i'm barely functioning <laughs> so i got my new herbal tea that i got from the shop um i did a fair bit of reading um this week is just gonna be like immense though work wise because i just there's just so much of it this week i don't know where it's come from it's usually quite manageable but this week it just seems really like just a bit too much so i might talk to my tutors about that because i feel like it's actually like the point where like i'm not gonna be i'm not gonna be able to produce good quality work because even if i did stay up to work i'd be too tired to do it so yeah i'm gonna have this cup of tea and go to bed before 12 p.m what Get up at eight tomorrow, do some bits and bobs, go to my lectures, try and get everything else done that I need to get done. Yeah. Same old, same old. Morning, guys. I am such a banana. I literally just, I, well, I'm not banana, I just slept, but <coughs> I needed to ring like five people and do loads of admin stuff and I haven't done it. And I don't, I'm not gonna have time to do it again today, so I'll have to do it tomorrow now. Or for it, oh, God. I'm so bad with admin, like genuinely, I'll do it when I get back today, but I have a lot of work to do again today. I've got two lectures, a class, and a shit ton of reading to do. Aim is, by the end of today, is to at least have a plan for the essay, like I can write it tomorrow if I have a plan. So, a vague plan will do, but that is going to take a lot of reading, so... Hey guys, I've been in the library reading about Gongra. My whole essay is just going to be other people's opinions because I literally just don't have any of my own. Anyway, um, I have been in there for too long. It's 9pm and the LMH Music Society are doing a concert tonight, like an informal concert where a few of the first years are singing and playing piano and doing stuff and I just need some wine and I need some music. So I'm going to go to that. Um, yeah, this... Just the Oxford workload, man. Like, I just feel like it's a bit stupid. Like, I hate seeing everyone else just like <laughs> having free time and sometimes it's just a bit like is this really necessary like i'm not gonna use any of this in later life and like i could i'd rather do like two texts in like great detail rather than doing a poet a week and me just frantically flicking through trying to find examples for an essay like just seems a bit stupid but hey ho so i'm gonna go to this for an hour anyway um and take my mind off it for a bit and then probably work I just want to get a plan done tonight and I will just bang it out tomorrow. It won't be the best essay I've ever written, but it'll be the best. <laughs>
What do you normally talk about? I just talk about what I'm doing. So we're in the bar, um, Eve's got some wine that I think she regrets ordering because she's got loads of loads of work to do. Like I'll show you the wine. It's a second glass, I think I'm on like half a bottle now. It'll make, it'll make my thoughts looser, no? My ex-best friend, like... Yeah, I was talking to a guy um, at dinner the other day, a PhD student, who was like, Oh, well, you work so much better now. after a glass of red wine. I've actually been What happens then? Like a bell curve. You go past Am I past the bell curve now? <laughs> hey guys, it's like 11pm. My brain is literally fried. I genuinely just like... I, I It hasn't been poor time management one part this week. That's why I'm annoyed. It's like I've done nothing different to what I normally do. I just like everyone else seems to have no work. Like everyone's like all the chemists and stuff are like, oh yeah, we finished for the week. I'm so jealous. Like I know they've probably had weeks where they've been much busier than me, but right now it's just like, even if I finish this essay, which I won't on time, because I just I want to go out tomorrow night. Like I want to have some fun this week. Even if I do finish this essay, it doesn't matter because then look, I've got a presentation to do, and then I have another essay to write, and it's just like. I'm just looking forward to Friday, which is my evening off. And by the time, then I've just got to get this essay written next Monday. And then if, oh my gosh, if I get to set another Spanish essay next week, I will cry. Like, I will actually cry. No, I won't. I won't. It won't. It's fine. Not going to think that far ahead because I will cry. Okay, night, guys. Good morning. Hi. I'm stressed. I'm late. I haven't brushed my teeth. Basically, I literally slept for like probably about two hours last night. I went to bed at quarter to 12 and I just could not sleep. Like genuinely, I lay there for a solid three hours just stressing about everything. And when I did fall asleep, I just had all these horrible dreams. It's like, why are you doing this to me, brain? Anyway, it's 8.45, I'm gonna be late for my class. I need to brush my teeth, I need to sort my life out. Um, and then I've got to miss my lecture to write this damn essay. And it's not like I've even left the last minute. Like I've been doing it for ages. Uh, I can't believe I'm having to miss a lecture to write an essay, which will then mean that I have more work, so I've got to catch up on the lecture. I just want this essay out of my life right now because it's given me a migraine, and quite frankly, I don't have the time for this shit. I want to live my life. I do not want to live my life chained to a desk. I don't like this dress, but I want to wear it because I bought it and it's just not very flattering. But hey, it's beautiful anyway. I don't know what is going on over there, but yeah. I ordered my takeaway from here and that's the Bullingdon. It's right next it's to it. Nice. Not Bernardo's, but look. Wait, the, the first floor. First floor. That that's <laughs> where I ordered my takeaway from. <laughs> Wait, what, what is it? Is Hey guys, it's a beautiful foggy day. Um, out, out in LMH. My room's a state. Um, I have a 9 a.m., I have a 12 a.m., or 12 p.m., which I don't usually have, which is kind of making me upset because I like my Thursdays. Um, then I have three hours of peer support training, and then I'm going for a Galentine's meal. Then I need to do the presentation that I've not done for tomorrow. So, all in all, not a bad day. Not a bad way to spend Valentine's Day either, to be fair. But yeah, I'm gonna go now because I'm late. So 
I'm with my gals. Wait, no, it's fine. I'm with my gals for Galentine's. Beautiful. What's this place called? Thai. Thai Koo. Looks delish. Good morning. Sorry I didn't really vlog yesterday. Um, We went on a Galentine's Day and then I just came back and I just sat on my bed and went on my phone and watched a film. I watched um, Music and Lyrics, which is such a shit film, but like I needed a shit film in my life. Um, So yeah, today is Friday. Um, It's jazz night tonight and we're going to a silent disco. But for now, I need to write my presentation on the use of mythology in Congress ballads, which I've mainly written, but I just want to make it a little bit more coherent so that my tutor does not think that I have rushed it, which I objectively have, but <laughs> that's okay. Um, so yeah, it's 7am now. I don't have a lecture till 11, so I've got like three hours to, to do it, um, which is not going to take me three hours, but I'm just happy because I can actually chill for once in my life. Like, I have work, but like, it's not imminent, so... I'm enjoying Friday while I can because Saturday and Sunday is just going to be me panicking at trying to get this essay done. So, yeah. Hey guys, so had quite a successful tube actually, but I was stupid and basically there's five ballads next week and we all have to do a commentary each because there's five of us on each of the five poems. And there are two that are not like, they don't have accompanying like critical articles to help you. And I was like, oh, next week's my chill week. And I know that everybody else has got like loads of stuff to do. So I was like, oh, I'll do it. Like I'll do one of them. And um, then forgetting that our tube's been moved a day earlier than this week. So I don't have Wednesday evening to do it like I normally do. <laughs> that was a bit of a dick move on my part, to be honest. But I'll do it anyway, like it's fine. But it just means that my chill week does not technically start until Wednesday now rather than Monday. But that's fine. Um, we're about to go for a walk, actually, because the sun's just setting. Um, and we just wanted to go for a little walk. I just really fancy a walk. I just do. So that's what we're going to do. Um, I've been listening to One Direction for like an hour and I'm loving life. Fridays are my day off, so I'm making the most of not having to do any work right now. <laughs> Jazz night was so good, but we're back now. We're going to a silent disco at the O2, which is going to be really, really fun. Lindsay's here to join the vlog clip. Hey, Olivia's also here to join the vlog clip. I can't just vlog in peace, can I, guys? No, carry on. We'll just. Um, yeah, we're going to the O2, aren't we? we I are. don't even know where the O2 is. It's for a silent disco. It's about 40 minutes walk. We're not walking. We're, not walking. <laughs> we're getting we're a taxi to the O2 and. It's a silent disco, which I've never been to before, but I could do with some tunes it's right now. Be fabulous. And we've got, we, we need to print our tickets off at Plodge before we leave. And where's Fionn? At the Plodge, can't we? Where is yeah. it Or the library. I need to print mine off at the library, actually. Mine's on the library printer. What did she say? What did Fionn say? She needs to print hers off at the library, too. But yeah. We're gonna, we're gonna print conclusion. <laughs> <laughs>
biggest thing I've ever seen is Coco on the vlog. Good morning guys, so it's 8.40. I literally was getting into bed last night and I had an alarm set for seven and I was like, you know what, no. I need to sleep through the night and I literally fell asleep at 12 and woke up at 8.40 and I feel so much better. Like I still feel tired but better, like so much better and in such a better mood. Today is just going to be a work day. Not fun but I have a lot of, a lot of work to do. Like a lot. But what, what's new? I mean I say this every time um, but yeah, no, I literally am just going to work, 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 work. Uh, probably until like until I'm done so it's gonna be a late night and then I'm gonna have to write the essay tomorrow morning and then I'm gonna have to go straight from that essay to the next essay so yeah I mean what's new but at least I'm at least I've slept that's one positive of this whole situation oh guys I just spent so much money I literally went to go and buy some mom jeans from Lucy Woods video and then I ended up spending you know what, I'm not even going to tell you how much I just spent on clothes. I literally went on Nasty Gal. I've never shopped on Nasty Gal and it came up on the side and I was like, ooh. And then they had a 45% discount and they had so many nice clothes. So prepare for a haul next week. Hopefully it'll all fit me, but yeah. Now I'm going to work. I'm actually going to work in my room today. Shock horror. Because I think it's so sunny and I just need the light. Like, I need to be, I need to be able to see the sun. And I've got a lot to do. So I'm going to get started now. Hey guys, so I'm just heading to the JCR meeting now. Um, David is running for student union officer, so obviously I'm going to give him some support. I was supposed to run for social backgrounds officer again, um, but I forgot to send in my manifesto. So they're going to reopen the elections, but I'm not here next time the elections are. So I need to talk to the people about it, but yeah, I just completely like slipped my mind to send in my manifesto. Um, I, I already have one because I've already run for it, so maybe they'll just let me talk tonight, but I don't know. Anyway, I'm bringing my laptop with me just to do a little bit more work. Um, and then have some free pizza, free drink. David, that starts with a D, that's for democracy. But, <laughs> but democracy, that's not just me, it's what you are and what you want to be. If you do PPE or the legal degree, if you like coffee, hot chocolate, hot tea, if you're a he, a she, a they, or a C, the SU is not me, not you, it's we. Thank you. Oh, man. <laughs> So I have put my laundry up, but there must somebody must have left something weird in my dark in the washing machine that I use for the darks because I've got like a pile there of stuff that's just got weird stuff on it. Like it's grim, like it's made it dirty. I'm not a fan of that. Betty, there's probably some of the stuff there as well. So I'm gonna have like low-key dirty clothes for like two weeks. I'm just gonna go pop and get my bed other bed sheets. Oh, I've already I've changed my bed, look. Oh, wow, I've edited my vlog on a Sunday, not the day before it goes up, I've edited it on a Sunday. It's small things, guys. But this vlog is obviously, like, shorter. They're just getting shorter, which I think is a good thing because I think, like, they're just getting streamlined. Um, but, yeah, I am going to try and film a main sort of sit-down video this week if I have a bit of time. Um, this week was, like, just a bit of a crazy work week, really, and just, like, as usual at Oxford, big highs, big lows. I really find that. I find that, like, you have moments where you're like, ah, and then you have moments where you're like, ah, yeah, but all is well. Um, I just wish I was on half term, to be honest, I could do with half term, uh, but I don't. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this vlog. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. Hopefully sixth week, after I get over this essay commentary, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, will be a nice week. Um, and yeah, can't believe we're in sixth week already. Feels like such a bubble here, and I hope if you went to VidCon you had a good time. But yeah, I'll see you very soon. Bye guys. Mwah.